Hello friends, we're here at Dollar Tree, and for any last minute gifts, look what we have for the animal lover in your life. Yes, I really do need all of these cats. All you need is love and a dog. Okay, and then um, enjoy the little things. Never look back. Believe you can, and this is a little puzzle pieces. We've seen them do this before. Life is an adventure. So these are really cute. This is coming out for Valentine's Day game cook together um the slow dance that's cool and then you have the red which of course rub back ooh la la time hug and we'll just put this one they have the red and the white and they have the black and the white and then we have kiss so these are really cute of course for gifts and valentine's day or you can play these dice in your bedroom see what you come up with fun stuff like that we also have ready-made pasta, and this is ready, fully cooked, ready in 60 seconds. You have Penny and Gamelli by Berea, a name brand. That is super cool. And for the dog lover in your life, look at these cute little photo clips. Good dog. I woof you. My dog is the reason I wake up in the morning. And there's another one. There was a white one. Good dog. Here's the... Th three that I'm seeing. Oh no, and I, there's two black ones. Okay, I woof you. Beware of kisses, good dogs. So these are super stinking cute. And again, great for the animal lover in your life. They also have these cute bath bombs in the rainbow, and they also have it in the rocket ships. Last minute gifts, pepper jalapeno cheese. Look at little stockings, minis, milk bones for the dogs. Let's see, are they made in China? Are they, no, made here in Ohio. Cute little treats. Wishkins, jungle fantasy. Little cool um, stocking stuffers. And then they also have the construction. Little cute stocking stuffers. Just little cute stuff for the children. And of course, that is awesome. And then of course I showed you some really cool stuff right now. We're going to keep going and seeing what else is here. Hello friends. All right. I just came from Dollar Tree and I spent $124. Yeah, let's be exact here. Um, I spent, let's see, I spent $124.31 all on Valentine's Day. Not one, well, I guess something could be for Christmas, but I didn't buy anything Christmas. I bought everything for Valentine's Day. So we're going to get into the haul. We're actually going to do it in my car because I don't have room in my house to be bringing this stuff in. So we're just going to do it in the car and just call it that. So it's a good one, you guys. A lot of new stuff, some returning items that are fun and we were excited about last year. And if you didn't catch them last year, maybe you can catch them this year. So anyways, let's get into the haul. All right, one of my favorite ones, and I don't know if these are new, but I don't remember seeing them being this big, and you'll see it in the thumbnail because it's almost, and they're bigger than my head, but I fell in love with these when I saw them um, in the catalog, and this is, I love the galvanized piece right there, the red ribbon against the pale pink. I'm really all about the pale pinks, lavenders, and those pastel colors. I really get over red because red is Christmas, you know? And coming out of Christmas, I definitely want to see these type of pastels. So hugs and hugs, kisses, and Valentine's wishes. And we have the galvanized at the top and a little red ribbon. Digging this. And again, I'm probably going to get a couple more because this is perfect for backdrop decor. And what I mean backdrop is if you have white walls like I do, those are boring. And I like to put this in the background and then decorate in front of it. And therefore, it just serves as a backdrop. And for a dollar twenty-five, why not? Right? Why not? All right. So they had that style. And then they also had it in the white. And this says, Happy Valentine's Day. And again, we've got that galvanized. And we have the red ribbon. Totally digging it. These are very, very big. I don't even know how to tell you. I mean, you'll see in the thumbnail how big they are. So, very, very large. All right. Some returning items. And I got these for my tree. Because I do do a Valentine's Day tree. 
I picked up um, a couple in pink and it has the pink tinsel. And if you're doing, um, you, you know what, for Christmas, if you want to keep these around, like for next Christmas, I would keep these. And if you're doing a glam Christmas, you could pull these gnomes out. Again, they do have the pink tinsel and they are here for Valentine's Day. Let me get out the red one so you can see. All right, so here's the red one, and this one is cute, too. Again, this looks like Santa Claus right now because we are in, I mean, it, tomorrow's Christmas, you know? So um, tomorrow's the 24th, right? Yeah, okay. So anyways, this looks like Santa Claus to me right now, but I know it is Valentine's Day. Again, I really went in heavy for the pinks and kind of left the reds alone, but I did grab one of these and it, because I put four one... After Christmas time, when I decorate the tree for Valentine's Day, Easter, 4th of July, etc., I start using really big pieces instead of like little ornaments like you do um, with Christmas. So I go for big space taker uppers, I guess is how you would say it. All right. So I did grab, like I said, a couple, I think I just grabbed one in red and the rest are in pink. So hold on. So I really only just grabbed four of these. I may get more. Oh no, I did grabbed one, two, three, four, five. So four in the pink and one in the red. And like I said, I should have grabbed more of those big, um, large mason jar ones. And then these are from last year. These were a big hit. Everyone liked them. They're the faux books. And it says, be mine forever. Lots of love. I just picked up two. And what I like about these is that you can use these as risers. They work. Um... Or you can use it as part of your decor. I am going to get some Ray Dunn ones this year, though. Um, and I picked up Love Bug Cutie Pie Sweetheart. So these are some returns, again, from last year. They're still really super stinking cute. You can redo them or leave them as is or add to them. You know, you could make it even more Valentini and add to it. So, yeah. All right. I'm going to put my receipt in my purse real quick that's flying around. So that's the first bag. Let me get, let me put the first bag away and then we'll get into more. Cause I mean, obviously if I bought $124 worth, you know, this is going to be a nice size haul. All right. These are new and these are beaded, um, hearts. These are all adult, everything. I don't have a dollar tree plus. This is all dollar 25. So I went a little crazy. I bought one, two and four. Now, Super stinking cute, right? I mean, honestly, I could see this in a high-end boutique. I could see it at Hobby Lobby. Um, and you could DIY these. Personalize them. Make wreaths. You can do all kinds of fun stuff with them. Super, super cute. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them, to be honest with you. Um, I may... I don't know. Wear them as a necklace? I don't know. I did shoot a, shoot a picture that might go in as a thumbnail, or I might put it in a thumbnail. Literally, my head can fit in it. So it's really a big item. All right, these are really, really super stinking cute, and they finally hit it. They got the gnomes right. Now, they don't have the big gnomes in yet, but I did score these cutie patooties for your um, tiered trays. Hold on, let me move these out of the way real quick. I'm trying to keep everything, like, nice and neat, which is really hard, because doing a haul in the car is not my usual forte. All right, look at these babies. Isn't he cute? holding up his little valentine and his little pastel look. So I picked up two of him. And then I got his friend who's holding a heart. Then I also look at, he's holding a stinking pastel heart with his little red and white gingham. Tell me those are not cutie patooties. I went a little bit nuts. You could just say I went a little, little nutty. But I wanted to make sure, because these are going to sell out really quick. And look at, we have the gray. I don't even know how many I bought. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah, I bought eleven of these bad boys. But they're cute. They are super stinking cute. And I'm thinking... Hold on. Sorry, you guys. I'm thinking tier tray all the way. All the way. So let me show you the ones individually so you guys can get a little kick out of it. Look at how cute they are. They came out with four different ones. We have not seen these. This They were not out last year. 
And I think they're kicking it up a notch since they did raise the pricing. Okay, I'm not sure what's going on with his little arm. But those are the ones. Those are the four designs. And, you know, they're cute to put in a mug. Start making your little Valentine's Day gifts. Top Or put this as like a little, t you know, kind of like cherry on the cake. Put it on top of the gift. Or put it in a mug. Or put it on top of some candy. You know, a lot of, I mean, I just, I can't get over how cute. These really, really look, honestly, they look nice. They feel great. They don't feel like they're super chintzy or anything like that. And I like them. Definitely worth $5. Sticking with gnomes, we have the one with the pink at the XOXO and the red with love. There was just two. Um, I'm sure there's probably more. But, um, again, I'll be hanging these on my tree. I like, when it comes to, like, Valentine's Day and, like I said, other holidays, with the exception of Christmas, I do big take big space taker uppers on the tree. It just makes it easier to decorate. So those guys are going to go on the tree. Uh, the camper, love you always. That'll maybe go outside on the front porch or on the tree. It just depends on how much room I've got on the tree. Kissing booth. This was last year. It's still cute. Again, I do like this for like backdrops and so forth to decorate in front of. Um, they also got the doggy. Nothing in the world is friendlier than a wag of a tail. So I got that for Fiancerelli. And then I bought, I got this. I mean, I don't have a cat, but I bought it so that you guys could see it. So, live, love, meow. I mean, it's kind of like, you know, a dog. You know, everyone's included, so I like that. Um, I fell in love with this. This is definitely going to go on the tree. Sealed with a kiss. Definitely am digging that pink and white gingham and the red and white polka dots. So, that's adorbs. And then we have this one. Follow your heart. Again, a little red for my taste, but, you know, it is Valentine's Day, and it'll look good against the white tree. All right, I'm not sure if I picked up all of the mason jars, but it, it was, like, really hard to get everything. It's just crazy. All you need is love. These are back again. We've seen these in previous years. They're still super cute. I think I'm missing a white one. Um, love makes everything better. Yeah, I'm missing a white one, but that's okay. You guys get the gist. Um, hugs and kisses in the red and white. So I thought that was super stinking cute. And I found my Tiffany and Company bracelet in my uh, bag. Well, I'm glad I found it, right? Better than losing it. Oh, I don't like carrying heavy bags. Hold on, you guys. I absolutely love conversation hearts. And these be mine with the um, green is adorable. These got messed up because you know everything was being packaged so quickly. And then love. Now, I like all of this because this is just all... I mean, I love seeing the pastels again. You know, as much as I love Christmas, got my ring on, got my ugly Christmas sweater, I do enjoy seeing my pastels. I have missed them. All right. Um, there's two more of the conversation hearts. I'm going to try and find them or we'll just have to go out of order because this is a big haul. Sticking with gnomes, we have the one with the pink at the XOXO and the red with love. There was just two. Um, I'm sure there's probably more. But, um, again, I'll be hanging these on my tree. I like, when it comes to, like, Valentine's Day and, like I said, other holidays, with the exception of Christmas, I do big take big space taker uppers on the tree. It just makes it easier to decorate. So those guys are going to go on the tree. Uh, the camper, love you always. That'll maybe go outside on the front porch or on the tree. It just depends on how much room I've got on the tree. Kissing booth. This was last year. It's still cute. Again, I do like this for like backdrops and so forth to decorate in front of. Um, they also got the doggy. Nothing in the world is friendlier than a wag of a tail. So I got that for Fiancerelli. And then I bought, I got this. I mean, I don't have a cat, but I bought it so that you guys could see it. So, live, love, meow. I mean, it's kind of like, you know, a dog. You know, everyone's included, so I like that. Um, I fell in love with this. This is definitely going to go on the tree. Sealed with a kiss. Definitely am digging that pink and white gingham and the red and white polka dots. So, that's adorbs. And then we have this one. Follow your heart. Again, a little red for my taste, but, you know, it is Valentine's Day and it'll look good against the white tree. 
All right, I'm not sure if I picked up all of the mason jars, but it, it was like really hard to get everything. It's just crazy. All you need is love. These are back again. We've seen these in previous years. They're still super cute. I think I'm missing a white one. Um, love makes everything better. Yeah, I'm missing a white one, but that's okay. You guys get the gist. Um, hugs and kisses in the red and white. So I thought that was super stinking cute. And I found my Tiffany and Company bracelet in my uh, bag. Well, I'm glad I found it, right? Better than losing it. Ugh, I don't like carrying heavy bags. Hold on, you guys. I absolutely love conversation hearts and these be mine with the um, green is adorable. These got messed up because you know everything was being packaged so quickly and then love. Now I like all of this because this is just all I mean I love seeing the pastels again you know as much as I love Christmas got my ring on got my ugly Christmas sweater I do enjoy seeing my pastels I have missed them. All right um, there's two more of the conversation hearts. I'm going to try and find them or we'll just have to go out of order because this is a big haul. Next up are these really cute signs and these are new with the floral print XOXO and you have one side that has that nice pastel floral and then the rest is faux ship lap and then you have the peekaboo heart on the inside and XOXO is in um, pink glitter. So that's a really nice find. Um, I tried to get all four but like I said it was you know, it was either shoot out of boxes or do a haul. So I decided just to buy the stuff and show you guys and just do a haul because it's really, um, I mean, it's not, it's, they're busy. I mean, it's December 23rd and to trying to shoot out of the boxes was just going to be a little bit crazy. So I just, just decided to buy, um, this says love. And then you have all the floral. Again, we're seeing an open heart, love and hot pink glitter. We also have kisses, and we're seeing, like, the beige faux shiplap, and then we also have the floral kisses in pink glitter. And then I think I've got a double, so I might be missing one, but that's okay. All right, let's keep going. Um, these, I did make sure I got them all in one. I got one in one. All right, love you always. I'm loving the light pink. We have the pink and dark pink gingham, the little heart, and that is cute. You can glue, you can hot glue these together and make your own sign. Hugs and kisses, very farmhousey with the faux shiplap, and then you have the heart with the gingham, and then loads of love with the red truck, and XOXO, and then the faux shiplap. And last but not least, we do have You Are Perfect in Every Way. So, here is how. Here's all four of them. Pretty. Very, very pretty. These galvanized hearts are back again. I think they're really, I think they're bigger. For some reason, they look bigger to me, but that could be just me. I did buy two and two. Love the I love you and the use of pink glitter and a little bit of red. I'm digging that burlap bow on the side. And again, I'm thinking um, Christmas, not Christmas tree, Valentine's Day tree. I will be using these. So I did pick up, like I said, I think I got doubles of each one. And then you also have this just says love. That's adorable with a little hand holding the heart. And then we have the three gnomes. And again, there might be a fourth one. I'm not sure. So let me show you real quick how all three of them look. There we go. Again, there might be a fourth one out there. I'm sure some someone who wants to nitpick me is definitely going to be like, you're missing this, you're missing that. I appreciate I, I definitely appreciate the construction the constructive criticism. Um, you know, it's just about how things are said. You know, if you want me to be nice to you, please be nice to me in the comment section and, and I'll be nice to you. But you know, if you guys are going to come out at me all crazy, um, I give back what you dish out. So like I said, I was definitely in a hurry and we're very lucky that the managers at Dollar Tree do like us because they do give us access early access to Christmas for every holiday I get early access to. And, um, you know, that's because 
I'm there a lot and you forge friendships with people um, after a while and I always want to thank you know certain Dollar Trees are very very kind to us and I definitely appreciate them and uh, we do show our appreciation so um, yeah all right let me keep you guys my the back seat of my car look at this this is the back seat of my car right now this is all dollar tree there's more dollar tree bags in the back it's just like wild those two bags are already filled up with dollar tree stuff as you can see there's gnomes peeking out so i'm trying to organize as i go so hold on all right i did get these arts and crafts this is more for like my nephew this is mailbox and it you could you make a mailbox, you know, it's just basically just arts and crafts. I did, and I also got them to show you. Um, XOXO, the gnome, that is cute. It's a little Valentine. These are mailbox kits. These are cute for school projects or to keep the children busy. Um, and gifts. And then you have the little doggy or adult, you know, hey, you can put these in your own home, you know. And then we have like the dinosaur. So bought these. Again, I'm, they're all going to go to my sister, you know. Her and my nephew can make these on a rainy day and just whatever. So, bought those. And these are super stinking cute. I don't know why I didn't get more, but look at these sticky paper flowers. You have it in the light pinks and the white and the glitter. And these would be cute to put on cards, envelopes. Mother's Day into spring, summer, Easter. It doesn't have to just, just be Valentine's. And then you have more of like the red and the lavender. And again, you can use these all year round. Great for arts and crafts. And you get a dozen in each package. So I don't remember seeing these. They're a little squished because they just came out of like all the boxing. All right. Then I picked these up. I, there's... I'm missing the other color, and it was light pink, but I like this, and this is going to be for, like, my wax melts. I'm not sure. I might use these for our keys, and then maybe use this for, like, wax melts or whatever. So, picked up that. And then here's the rest of the conversation hearts. We have Cutie Pie. And hold on, there's another one. Everything's just kind of jumbled up. And then we have XOXO. And look at it. I think this we had these out last year. Hugs and kisses. Fast and free delivery. And then you also have loads of love special delivery. Now, this is great decor. And I bought a bunch of them. Because this is awesome for, again, the tree. They're metal. Galvanized. Let me undo them. And they are decoration for the tree. So, basically, I don't even know. You know, I think she probably only charged me. <laughs> I think she just ran it through. I don't think she realized that. There's three in here. So, there's the pink, the galvanized, and the red. Hold on. All right. So, I did pick up several of these. I think I got, like, a couple of packs because they are together. They're not separate. So, I think she just charged me for one. But there's the pink one with the red glitter heart. Then they did red with pink glitter heart. I like the little bow. Again, this is perfect, perfect, perfect for your Valentine's Day tree. And they have the galvanized with the heart. All right, this is I did pick up for my nephew. It's just a little cutie. He, they can dec I mean, I know they'll be decorating his room. And the little dinosaur with the heart. Thought that was cool. These are new. And... If you like owls, you're going to like these. These are glass. They have the little owls sitting together with the twine. And then they have this, these owls just kind of winking and floating around, kind of doing their own thing. And I'm, I mean, there's more, you know, they only received a certain amount of boxes. All right. Um, I love these, these little hearts for my mini trees. And you can always use the white Christmas trees that they sell at Dollar Tree during Christmas time for your Valentine's Day tree or your and your Easter tree. I also like these as well for Valentine's Day, the pink hearts. I did get a couple of the ones in red. I'm not going to show you like all of them because you see one, you get the picture. Like there's, I think I got three of the red. 
Then they also had these. My dog is the reason why I wake up in the morning, and it's a little picture holder. These are cute for Christmas gifts or for Valentine's Day. And good dog. And then I did get this for fancy stocking, milk bone flavor, snacks, minis for dogs of all sizes. Just going to stick that in there. In fact, I'll throw it in my purse because this stuff is going to stay in the car. I don't have room for it in the house right now. All right, so that's one bag full. So let me organize this and then we'll get into the next part. All right, these are staples and you'll see these at the 99 cent store as well. And I bought it in pink and in red. And you know what I use them for? Soap holders, not like bars of soap, but like, you know, um, you can use bath and body soap pumps, soap bottles, or your dish liquid. Um, mine is in a, it's always in a festive um, pump, and I just use these as the, um, how would you say it? Caddy. And I just put it in the middle, and it works. So I always use these, and then by the time, you know, February's done with these are kind of ready to be chucked because they've been they've had water and we have really hard water at our condo so like it sometimes it seeps into the inside so these are just basically kind of just good for the season because they get usually I put one in the master bedroom and I put one in the kitchen and yeah they get kind of waterlogged but they serve their purpose um and then also Happy Valentine's Day. Sorry, you guys. I'm going to turn on the car, the air a little bit. Hold on. All right. Sorry about the air conditioning sound, but it's getting a little stuffy in here. All right. Happy Valentine's Day. This is new. I like that leopard heart. That is super stinking cute. And then, like I said, I did buy a couple more of these and more of the hearts. So, all right. Hold on. Oh, I also got these crazy straws for my hot cocoa bar. I thought these would be cute. And they're just fun, you know? They're plastic, they're cute. You get six pieces in yellow and pink, crazy hearts. So I was like, yeah, I'll take a pack of those. Why not, right? And I forgot about this little guy. I usually don't buy stuff like this, but like I said, we were like in a rush. And anyways, he's cute. Now I know why it was so hot. My seat heater was on, that's why. Anyways, he's just holding this little, he's a little tinsel guy. I, I'd never buy this stuff. It just says love. He'll go outside. All right. Um, the reason why I have this blanket, it's a Ray Dunn blanket from Halloween. It actually says boo is because I cover up bags in my back seat, especially during Christmas, because, you know, I don't always go home after I go to a first store. So I don't like people being able to see like what's in the backpack. And that's why there's this blanket here. So... It's actually coming in use today because I'm shooting a haul in the car. All right, they also came out with some really cute yard stakes. So let me show you those as well. Look at how pretty that one is. Kisses, 25 cents. And look at all those hearts exploding out of that pink envelope. That is absolutely fun. We also have Be Mine. You have that big heart coming out of that red envelope. And you can take these apart. They're very easy to take apart. And you can use them as um, ornaments for your Valentine's Day tree. You can use them to wreath. All kinds of stuff. All right. And then I'm pretty sure we've seen these before. The trucks. This says Struck by Love. And it has the hearts. I love you. Um, and then we also have the pink heart, follow your heart, XOXO. All right, you guys, that wraps up the haul. I pretty much condensed it into two big, um, home goods bags. And yeah, um, super excited. There was a lot of new stuff. This bag has a lot of the new stuff, like the new gnomes, the heart beads, wreath, heart bead wreaths. And I was able to get a lot of my wish list items checked off. I'm just going to, I'm looking for the big gnomes. Those will probably come in. If not this week, then we definitely certainly following next week. And I hope you all enjoyed this Valentine's Day 2023 haul. I know a lot of people just want to get through Christmas and are not ready for this. But um, I do like to shoot early. And I like to be able to show all the friends of the channel giving you guys, I give you the option to watch it 
that's what I like to do. So I hope you all enjoyed it. As always, have a wonderful day, wonderful evening. Definitely check out Marshall's and, um, yeah, check out Marshall's, you guys. That was a good one. I do cover lots of great Valentine's Day stuff at Marshall's and gift sets, last-minute shopping. I will see you all later, my friends. Thank you so very much for joining me. I truly appreciate it.